Hello everyone, welcome to the Physiotherapy, Exercise and Physical Activity course. Um, I am Rachel Lowe, I'm a founding director at Physiopedia, one of the organisers of this course, and my fellow organiser Anne Gates is here with me today. Hello Anne. Hi everybody. Anne is the founder at Exercise Works, and we have worked with Anne and built a course around the content that she has at Exercise Works to bring you this six week course on physical activity. Um, so, Anne, I was wondering if you might be able to just tell us a little bit about um, your story and how Exercise Works came about. Well, welcome everybody, and I'm delighted that in conjunction with uh, Physiopedia, we're running this physio, uh, physiotherapy exercise and physical activity course, or what we're calling under the hashtag Pepper16. Um, and about myself, well, I'm actually a clinical pharmacist by training, and I spent um, probably about 10 years of my career in primary care and 10 years in hospital care working as a clinical pharmacist. Uh, uh, assistant Director of Modernisation within the NHS and also um, I became a Director of Strategic Planning in the NHS for Mental Health Trust but was also Head of Health Strategy for a Strategic Health Authority and what that meant was that my focus was very much on chronic disease, non-communicable disease or long-term disease conditions um, and I realised that I got a wealth of experience in that area and when I left the NHS, um, I was very fortunate to spend some time in Antigua, in the Caribbean, and um, I had a bit of a eureka moment, and this was a professional eureka moment, because I realised that wherever you lived, um, be it, you know, in poor areas, lower middle income countries, and, and, you know, the Caribbean is quite challenged on that in lots of ways, but people, I saw people having fun and enjoying physical activity and the, how important that was in the prevention and treatment of disease. And I came back and I, I felt wonderful because obviously I, 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 I was relaxed and, and, and uh, having had a long extended holiday. But, but also I got to work, it inspired me. And so I did a gap analysis on where physical activity was within the health, healthcare system. Was it part of care pathways? Was it uh, you know, routinely uh, offered to patients? Because the evidence for exercise, even in just comparison with medicines, is enormous. Um, you know, there's been systematic reviews done to say that it's, it's, it's as good as, if not better than medicines in, uh, and certain treatments in certain areas. And so um, one day, Exercise Works was decided. Um, and I was very excited and that passion has continued, um, I, you know, throughout. I love my job and I love what Exercise Works does. And, you know, we've had great successes along the way. So in the meantime, um, I'm also a member of the World Heart Federation Emerging Leaders Programme, which is, I'm very honoured, but it's also a very prestigious opportunity to lead on heart health and promote cardiovascular health, both in prevention and treatment. Um, I'm also an associate editor for the British Journal of Sports Medicine, which has given me an opportunity to advocate very strongly for the role of healthcare professionals in the promotion of um, physical activity. And so this has all culminated in this summer, which has been fantastic because we're running this course, which starts on the 4th of July 2016, and um, that um, fulfils what my mission was three years ago when I was on the World Heart Federation Emerging Leaders Programme in a very cold um, Canadian town called Hamilton. I think it was minus 15 when we were asked <laughs> and said, you know, what would you do to change the world? And I quite chirpily said, well, I, you know, I change it by making sure that every healthcare professional can give physical activity advice um, confidently, competently and capably. And that's, this is where this course has. So the physiotherapy, exercise and physical activity course is a culmination of those years' work. So I'm delighted to welcome all the participants uh, for this summer's course. Excellent. That's a really good story. Um, I have to admire your enthusiasm for, for making us all become physically active and, and, and improving health in that way. So what? So, so exercise works. So what it culminated in was a series of resources, educational resources that you have at Exercise Works. Um, and so what we've done is taken those resources and built a course around them, this open course. So this open course will be 
six weeks long. You, everyone will have eight weeks to complete the course. Um, uh, there will be lots of reading, lots of learning activities, lots of discussion forums, lots of quizzes, lots of different things to do on the course to encourage you to learn how to integrate physical activity into your um, into the contacts that you have with clients in your in your work in health professional work. So. Um, yeah, so we're looking forward to having everyone on the course. There are going to be over 4,000 people have registered for this course. So it's going to be a very active course. We hope everyone doesn't get lost. So bear with us. Um, join in the fun. Um, and I, I hope that everyone will enjoy this course and learn a lot from it. Um, and we're very grateful to work with Anne and be able to use her exercise works resources. Um, and we hope you all learn a lot from them. So Anne, is there anything else that you would like to say to all the participants before we encourage them to get going on this course? I'd just like to say that the, you know, the quality of this course has be, it's been well established. It was actually originally evaluated by the University of Nottingham, um, funded by Public Health England. And the evaluation of the quality of the course came back as 8 out of 10. So I'm delighted to be offering um, the course uh, really globally um, to anybody interested in physical activity. I think that's a key point. This is this is a you know an open course um, available to all, but especially healthcare professionals uh, in whichever country you, you know they live in. But also to thank the very um, uh, excellent work done by over thirty authors of the resources. We originally uh, produced the course for undergraduate healthcare education, and the resources have been endorsed also by the Council of Deans of Health. Um, for use at university level, at undergraduate level. Uh, and, but what we wanted to do and was what was part of the World Heart, uh, Heart Federation Emerging Leaders course was to open these up to low and middle income countries very specifically. And obviously through your networks and your connections, that's, that's our ideal uh, platform for um, offering uh, the course to. But I'd just like to say that, you know, this was a multidisciplinary um, devised course with with some great people all around the world and so I'd like to thank on behalf of the participants um, uh, and the authors I'd like to thank everybody for all their all their contributions so thank you excellent it's you know it's a very well validated set of resources um, and course that we will be working with for the next six weeks so we're looking forward to that um, yeah, so I guess it just leaves us to say uh, again, welcome and enjoy the course. And both Anne and I, I know Anne is as well, looking forward to chatting with everyone in the discussion forums because that's where we will do a lot of our learning. So we will see you all there. Look forward to seeing everybody in the summer. Thank you very much. Thanks, Anne.